In Chapter 3-1 of Radiant Dawn, the Laguz Alliance presses the attack, but they have no idea how to attack a fortified position. So, Soren is tasked with drafting a plan to take the fort by deception. Mist, Leith, and Lyre don disguises to give the Night Watchmen drugged food, which puts them to sleep. With this, we begin the map where we have 12 turns to route all of the guards so we can open the gate and let the main force in. This map is relatively laid back because all of the Grail mercenaries are extremely strong compared to the enemies that you face. This is in stark contrast to the Dawn Brigade, who were clear underdogs. Hopefully, we will never have to play as them ever again. I start considering which units I want to train for the next few chapters because I need to make plans for my endgame team composition. Oscar, Rolf, and Boy are all of particular interest because they are one of two sets of units that can execute triangle attacks, allowing them to perform guaranteed critical hits with 100% accuracy if they are positioned correctly. So I do my best to give the brothers some XP and route to finish the map. With this, we open the gate, allowing the Galleon forces to capture the town. As the chapter closes, several of Ike's former companions join the team, adding Ileana and several parts units to our army. 